Hey everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Carly Tanager and we are playing some Fallout 3 Broken Steel DLC. I decided to do this one first because it's a very nice segue from the main storyline into Broken Steel, so I figured it's just a good place to start. I mean, suggestions were to do other ones first and I was looking up what's the best order, but I decided to do this one first because of all the aforementioned reasons. So over here we got Sentinel Lions, uh, still in a coma. I didn't really explain- I'm- I'm stuck. There, there we go. Okay, stuck. I'm not stuck. So I have to go find- Hi, Fox. I had hoped you'd return. What now? You come with me! With all due haste. Goddamn right. You're fired, Fox! I no, we love follow. Fox. Fox's friend. Presence detected. This unit has activated. Also, I still need to- I need to go get dog meat. And I need to make Fox and Dog Meat essential because I yes, I will console command all of my companions to be essential because it frankly I think it's bullcrap bull, or bullshit that your companions can die. I think I have to yeah, I have to go here. Um thankfully they fixed that in Fallout 4. All of the companions are essential up to a certain point. Uh, like you can get Paladin Dance killed if you side with the brother or side against the brother of steel at some point, blah blah blah. And then No. I don't go down here. I don't I don't think I go down here. Yeah, I don't think so. Also I really need to install the mod that lets me sprint. Hail. Hail <laughs> Okay. I'm looking at the right press right now, right? Yes, death from above! Oh god, we're far. <laughs> yes, there is a mod that lets you sprint in this game like you can in Fallout 4. I wish I had it. But I've been lazy. I meant to install mods after finishing the main game. Nothing much, just like texture overhauls, the sprint function, etc. I'm just lazy. I'll do it eventually, because I already have all of the stuff put together for Fallout 4 to mod that game, and it's the same freaking program to manage the mods. I'm just... Again, I'm lazy. Uh, Fox, you're in my way. Is he down here? I think he's down here. Roth, my child! Hey. You're, you're Peabody. You! Well, it's good to see that you're on your feet again. <laughs> for now. I assume lion is immediately throwing you to the wolves? Sounds about right. Has he told you what's been going on while you've been resting? Um... He said he'd give me the details. Well, Owen does have quite a bit on his mind lately. As yeah, like his daughter being so in a coma. Can imagine. This is the first time the actions of the Brotherhood have affected him in such a... personal manner. Like his daughter being Please, in a coma. step over here. I'll bring you up to speed. As I stop him from going anywhere. <laughs> Get out of my way! I really like the scribe armor, or well, robes, I guess, because it's all I'll red give and you stuff. A brief history of what's happened over the last few weeks and what's going on now. As you well know, you could at least began with the face me when you're talking to me, here. my dude. There we go. Good. Thanks to you, their main headquarters here was utterly destroyed. They then suffered Raven a Rock. I blew it up. Fire. Based on a combination of intelligence and field reports, other enclave locations throughout the wasteland were found. Cut off from their leadership, it was expected that their forces would be in complete disarray. This has not been the case. Of course not. Based on data and tech gathered from these locations, we've determined that the enclave forces are still maintaining remote communications. We isolated the transmissions and found their origin point, an old military installation in Rockland, to the southwest. Adams Our Air Force Base. Scouts have checked over the I area, think. but no easy access to the facility was found. So we're making our own access point. We're blowing shit up. Tristan is leading the team setting up forward base in an old car tunnel near the site. Once he's settled, Liberty Prime will be deployed. Prime's directive is to neutralize their defenses and create an entry point for the team. The team will move so the giant and I got it, then it will work. inside and cut off their transmitter. Any relevant data should be brought back here. Now, 
Did you have any other questions? Yes, can I have like a fat man and 50 bajillion missiles? If there's anything else you'd like to know, I'll tell you what I can. Otherwise, Paladin Tristan will be waiting. I'll alert him that you're on. Um, as the video crime holding up. Performance is exceeding all our expectations. Yeah, Madison Lee to thank for that. He's been especially effective against the Enclave's vertebrates, for which we previously had no counter. Except your own vertebrates. We are fine tuning his programming as we go. I guess they don't have the lots whole, of vertebrates at this point. I'm pleasantly even though surprised. They usually it's have a bunch of vertebrates. As I always suspected, Prime's real issue was energy management, and when Doctor Lee helped us solve that problem, well, <laughs> the rest was. Easy. Yeah, and now Dr. Lee's like, you guys are using my work for war? And Fuck you, I'm so going to the well. Institute. Who's going to use my work for war? I like Madison Lee, but her, um... Her logic sometimes is a bit flawed. Just a smidgen. Hi, Fox. Come on, we gotta get skedaddle. Gotta go say hi to, uh... Well, Paladin Tristan. So for those of you who are wondering, um, years ago I started a Fallout New Vegas playthrough, and just to put suspicion to rest, I am planning to do Fallout New Vegas again, restarting it, because the reason why Fallout New, uh, Fallout New Vegas ended up stopping was because it was just so, the game is so large that I couldn't wrap my head around what's playing it very well. Um, but I kind of like the system I had go have going here with Fallout 4 and, uh, where are you? Right. Welcome. The system I have going on here with Fallout 4 and, uh, Fallout 3 where I record the main storyline and only the main storyline and I record the main storylines of the DLCs and only the main storylines of the DLCs for YouTube. And then if I want to play it and do exploring and all that jazz, I play it on Twitch. That's made me wrap my head around it much easier, much better. Because then I'm just sitting here like, is this Let's Play going to be going on for 200 parts? As I try to 100% the game on YouTube? I'm going to get nothing else done! <laughs> so yes, after all the DLC for... You run funny, dude. After all the DLC for Fallout uh, 4, or Fallout 4, Fallout 3 is completed. I'm going to be doing New Vegas. Now, I might be doing Nuka World for Fallout 4 between those, which is the only Fallout 4 DLC I never did. And as an explanation there, the reason I didn't do that one is because it's an evil DLC. There's not- what the- Oh shit! Um, Nuka World is an evil DLC. If you're not playing an evil character, don't play that DLC. Especially because you can literally cause Preston Garvey to go hostile to you. So it wasn't really something I could do with my Minutemen general character. Or as if you were watching my Let's Play on YouTube, my Institute character! But I retconned her into a Minutemen character. Because I just loaded a previous save before the inst before um, the point of no return, and then went around and just blew up the Institute. Uh, wait, what? Whoa, what are you doing? What are you- what are you doing? I didn't get any freaking. Yeah, okay, Fox. Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Thankfully, Remothered isn't a long game. Neither is Clock Tower. I could probably do the entire Let's Play for Clock Tower in like two or three episodes, because that's not a long game. I'm just rambling. This is more like an update video than a Let's Play. I do goofed. <laughs> I just got distracted back there somewhere. <laughs> he, he runs so funny, I can't help but laugh at him. Okay, how far am I from... Okay, we're not that far. Not, not that far. Actually, pretty close to another place, it looks like. Tea trailing campground! Go <laughs> blurgle. What is... What are you looking at, my dude? Oh. oh you went. I got very mad. Well, he killed it. It's dead now. <laughs> it's very dead now. So we're going off into, like, bumfuck nowhere here. Oh, he's a campsite. Fox is a campsite. See the... Oh. No. No, Fox. Fox. That's why you like this. No, leave the death claw alone. No, Fox. Fox, why? Wait, is it dead? Dude, you're a beast. Okay, Fox, we're going this way. Don't go into the campground. Fine. Might as well go into the campground, I guess. To finish this fight that you started. Oh, God! Yagwai, Yagwai, Yagwai. I'm gonna die. 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 I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Eat the Blamco mac and cheese. Um, eat the promised steak. And eat the cramp. And the dandy boys. And the dirty, and the dirty water. Yeah. And this thing. And this. And these. And this. And, and, and all of these. And some of these. Okay. Leave me alone. Oh, hi, Fox. Uh. Sorry. <laughs> that was too easy. Hold on. Fox just does everything for me, so it's fine. Oh, he's crawling sick. That's it. Aw, oh, I saw my pork and beans or something. Okay, we found a campsite made of exploded stuff. <laughs> Sadly, it is not what we need to actually find. My god, this place. Must be measured. Yeah, okay, Fox. This place is, um... Oh, oh, this looks like a bad place to be. We're gonna go up this way. <laughs> that, that looked like either Mirelurk eggs or Deathclaw eggs. I want to say they're Mirelurk. Which means I don't want to go... It's green! Fox, are you seeing this? It's an actual green plant! I'm going insane. They purposely left the color green out of the overworld except for one or two areas in this game. Now I don't count the oasis because the oasis is a storyline thing. Um, but there is actually flowers. Like actual non-radiated green pretty flowers. In like one place. In the entirety of Fallout 3. And it's in the Arlington Cemetery. Which is a real life cemetery. It's a place for, um. <clears throat> it's a place that the military honors deceased soldiers at the Arlington Cemetery. And the developers actually made that the only place where a couple of the graves, just a couple, have flowers on the graves. And I just thought it was a very nice touch. But. But. Okay, you killed it. Um. How do I get. Can I mountain goat this? No. Fuck, how do I get up there? Can I go this way? Can I like cheatsy? Cheatsy mountain go my way up. Cool! That works. <laughs> okay, I see the place. Shouldn't the birdie prime be here? What you doing, Fox? I feel like the birdie prime should be here. Oh Jesus! I don't want to die here! <laughs> Why? 
Why is it always me? <laughs> Hi, how you doing? Could you please, like, freaking stop eating my face? You rude. Now that yeah, yeah now that that Yao is done being a jerk face. Okay, Fox, where the hell are you? My dude. Um. Oh, there he is. Like, hi. Are you are you gonna join us, Fox? I can't actually play the music. Because copyright. Yes? Yes? You rang? Can I steal stuff? Ooh. I take this. I take these. I take- I'm just gonna take everything. Yoink! Yoink! Darts? Eh, why not? Eh, why not? Okay, Fox, you're my way. <laughs> Come now, Fox. Anything here that's worth it? Worth, like, anything? No, not really? Okay, but bye. Oh! <laughs> Suddenly, Brotherhood of Steel. Oh. It's a big tunnel! They've been digging their way to the enemy? Hey, well, nerd! Well, look who's back amongst the living! For now. <laughs> Some of us were starting to wonder if you and Sarah were going to pull through. Well, Sarah's still unconscious. Good to see you, too. I'm here to help. Is that so? Well, it'll be good to have another soldier we can count I on. No, soldier! Basic rule of thumb on these operations. I'm a city. Keep your head down and let the robot do most of the heavy lifting. Okay. He can take it better than you can. Uh, what do you need me to do? I need you to keep your head on straight. No heroics, okay? No, but that's Liberty what I'm Prime good at. Liberty Prime is called in to assist with the initial assault. Once we've cleared ourselves a nice staging area, we'll reassess the situation. Come on. Things should be underway by now. Come on. Time to go explode some shit. It's been pretty standard for the last week or so. We get intel on positions, go in and burn them out. Huh, that's an interesting way to have done it. So what they did here, that's an on, that's an enclave soldier. So instead of just putting like the, the armor down for him to work on, they just put a soldier I can't complain laying down. Casualties down. That's an interesting way to have done that. And just made him non-moving and non-hostile and taking away his AI. Some communications facility. Mm-hmm. So we need to blow it up to scramble up the communications for the Enclave. So they can then be destroyed. I'm thinking if it's active, we can find out who they're talking to and get the last of the locations nailed down. Okay. Move faster. I'm just gonna Oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep rooting into his backside until he freaking moves. Oh, hey, I wonder what this could be. Wait, what? Oh, shit! Oh, double shit. It's my boy! It's my boy engaging them commies. Ooh! It's my boy engaging them commies all damn day. Democracy is non- God, I love Liberty Prime. <laughs> Liberty Prime is freaking great. Communism is a lie. I should have a plasma gun. I probably could have gotten a plasma gun, but... It takes efforts, and I haven't actually done any side questing in the back- Oh, jeez. Side questing in the background? Wait, what? You okay there, Fox? Threat assessment minimal. Communist threat assessment minimal. <laughs> Why are they shooting at me and not the giant dude trying to wreck their shit up? They're like, no, let's attack the rando on the frickin' wall, or, well, ledge, I guess. Cliff? I don't know. They can't save me. Ooh! 
Time to go says a nine Chinese victory. Impossible. <laughs> yeah, okay, dude. America harder. <laughs> America harder, my friend. America harder. Satellite uplink. America harder. Must make everyone naked to add to their humiliation. Cause I'm just awful. Uh oh. Red Chinese orbital strike imminent. Orbital All strike? Should reach minimum safe distance immediately. Oh right, I remember this. Oh. My dude. My dude. <laughs> My dude did not run fast. Initiating core shutdown. No, the mini prime. Emergency. Why didn't they do that against the Project Purity attack? Zero, nine, nine, I die so that democracy may live. We need to find out what the hell just happened. Orbital strike, duh. There's you know no something that's illegal by the space treaty? that base and help the troops locate the source of their transmission. Now, soldier, now! Okay. I don't know, I don't know. Terminals, data, anything. Okay. So as a sort of explanation, or to what I just said, you see a lot- okay, I can't loot them. Um, can I- is there any entrance? Um, oh, up here. So there's something called the Space Treaty, right? and you often see in video games and things like that, They'll talk about, oh, there's this thing in space that's going to rain death and destruction down on everyone. But the problem with that is that there's this thing called the Space Treaty. And the Space Treaty says, uh oh, that, you, that no country who is part of the Space Treaty, which is a lot of them, including the U.S., are allowed to install things like nuclear weapons in space. Um, weapons of mass destruction. They're not allowed to put weapons of mass destruction in orbit around the planet. And a lot of video games either forget that, gloss over it, or just say, oh no, they're the bad guys, so they just ignored it. it. Just completely ignoring the fact that so many countries would, like, see that shit happening before it happened. Like, oh hey, what's the U.S. doing? Building this giant space laser. <laughs> yeah, so I, I just kind of roll my eyes whenever I see, oh no, an orbital strike from a space station that the rest of the world didn't know about. Like, I can see the ISS from my house. Granted, it just looks like a really fast star zooming across the planet, but you still see it. Okay, okay, somebody's gonna die. You, you, uh, game, L let me target. Thank you. You're gonna die. And I'm going to make you naked. And you're gonna be embarrassed. Did we lose anyone? No? Okay. I'm just gonna take a second and, like, <laughs> loot these guys. Because they have entirely too much clothing on. I mean, it's hot outside. It's 100 degrees here right now. Thankfully, I have an air conditioning unit in my room. Because I need it for the bunnies. I don't want them to overheat. Also, they're being adorable and trying really, really hard to distract me from my recording. They're failing, though. For now. <laughs> Where are you guys running from? You gotta go this way, nerds. At least I think. Roar. Oh, fudge nugget. <laughs> Hello, dude. I kill your face. With my weak ass laser pistol. <laughs> um, Fox. Oh, Jesus. Jeebus. Jeebus. Okay, he's dead. 
I think I have lots of bullets for this freaking thing. Okay, could you stop hitting me, please? Like, why do I have aggro? I'm not the most dangerous person in this room. Because my shot, my shooting is shite. Huh? It's like, no, I must kill you in particular. Because I have realized that you are the protagonist. Ad Victorium, Paladin! Dun, dun, dun. Okay, my dudes. My dudes. You are in the way of my glorious, glorious task of making everybody naked. This is more important than your stupid little petty squabbles. I have to make everyone naked, okay? Is this the thing with the stuff? No. Okay, it must be in the other room then. Fuck, you're my way. It's because I have too much of an entourage. I have three Brotherhood uh, knights, and I have Fox with me. And they're just following me like ducklings. Well, foxes. Fall back. I don't want to. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Murder them with extreme prejudice! Ow. That hurt a lot. <laughs> Need no, I don't. I didn't want the self boy. Damn it. Okay, I used self boy. Oh no, I feel sorry for the the scientist lady. <laughs> she's a non-combatant, and my dudes murdered her. But that doesn't mean she's not gonna be naked. Oh Jesus. Okay, naked. I think I'm going the right way. <laughs> One can only hope. Naked. I'm gonna end up walking out of here with thousands and thousands of pounds of shit. Yeah, Brotherhood of Sterl! Nom. Nom. <laughs> I'm just pushing it all in my face. Oh no no Fox, how did you come from downstairs? Like, oh I fell. <laughs> Stop your glitching, dude. Oh hey, this looks like the place where they had their num nums. Which means Oh Darn it, I was hoping they'd have like food I could steal. But now they just have empty milk bottles. Ooh, isn't this spoopy? Oh wait. <laughs> oh. They're all dead. <laughs> I feel like I'm almost a, um, what's the word? Just bystander who's watching this shit happen? Cause I ain't doing shit right now. Compared to these guys. Which reminds me, I need to install the mod that makes it so when my companion kills something, I actually get experience points. Because in this game, if your companion kills something, you don't get experience points, even if you're like, helping to kill the thing. Which is dumb. Okay, guys, come on. Let's be spoopy. Super spoopy and stealthy. Okay, this place is like gross. Oh Jesus! Come on, be here. I bet I got something with a sniper scope on it. Oh, I know I do. I have a sniper rifle, <gasps> but like a laser sniper rifle. That'd be cool. But instead, I just have this little weak ass thing here. Okay. Um, you guys have fun. I'm going to loot everything! <laughs> you guys have fun murdering everything. I am instead going to loot everything. And laugh at the misfortune of the people around me. Um. Oh no. Oh no, it's the Gatling laser glitch. Where sometimes when the Gatling laser gets used, talk to it away from me. The Gatling laser noise won't stop! I won't stop! Oh, please tell me it stops me going to another area. Damn it, I was hoping that was going to go into another area. Okay. Okay, thank God. Uh, sever uplink. 
Update standing orders. Download some data. Damn. Okay, my dude. Knock it off with your glitching ass gla Gatling gun, please. Here, try and kill this. Maybe that'll make it stop. No. Of course not. We just get to listen to this shit go on for like until we get out of here. Yeah, okay, my dude. We're just gonna go out to the capital wasteland. Okay, thanks. Phew, the sound stopped. Hey, dude. So, do I go back to the Citadel? I do. So, I'm thinking... Okay, can't fast travel. So, I was thinking of doing one quest per video. And this one was Death From Above. So, as soon as Death From Above is over, we are going to end the video. Which means I have to go all the way over to the Citadel. <sighs> Come on, Fox. I love how we didn't even like check in with the paladins or the knights that were with us. We were just like, now, peace, bro. I'm out of here. I gotta go back to the Citadel to deliver some shit. <laughs> how are we gonna level from this? Oh, wow. I have over a thousand, uh, bullets for this. I should probably use them with a gun. Seeing as I don't think this thing is actually that good. And I probably have quite a few plasma rounds at this point. But you know, that requires effort. Aqua pure cake. Cake? Cake. Cake. The aqua pure is the purified water that they get from the Project Purity setup and they're distributing it around the wasteland so everyone can have fresh, clean, purified water. Because this Brotherhood is the good Brotherhood. The Brotherhood of Steel and Fallout 4 is evil. They're awesome. But you cannot claim that they are the moral just, superiority in that I game. I can't believe it! All but. those years of work, all of it! For <laughs> what? One botched operation? I'm still waiting on the debriefing from Tristan, but I'm not sure it even matters. With Prime gone... Mm. It could worse, they could have attacked the Citadel. Well, there's certainly nothing stopping them from doing that now, is there? Yeah, why didn't they do that before? And with our primary defense gone, I don't know what we can do to stop them. I need more to work with. We got some data. Ah, yes. Well, I'll see if we can't figure out how to read it. Perhaps it can give us some insight as to just what happened out there. It would be good to salvage something from this mess. Thank you for bringing well, Liberty this Prime to me. did say Orbo I strike. believe Elder Lyons will want to speak with you as well. Perhaps you should find him. If you'll excuse me. Dun dun dun! Okay, is that it? Man, I was hoping I'd turn this quest. Okay, report to Elder Lyons. Hey, Lions! I need to I talk to your face. With Rothschild. I hope he can make some headway with the data you've recovered. One can only with hope. our primary weapon destroyed, we risk losing our momentum and jeopardizing the entire campaign. We can't have that now, can't I we? I must admit, I now wonder whether moving ahead with this operation was an error in judgment. You couldn't have known what would happen. No one knew that there was an orbital and strike. Yet, here we are. <laughs> Discounting the fact that our best field commander is in a coma, True. and my personal feelings for my daughter, things have not gone well. If we fail now, we could lose everything. Well, we just won't have to do that then. We have to keep fighting. We can't back down now. Room here believes in you, and in the Brotherhood, we can do this. I sincerely hope you are. We got this. Just if we kill that Maxon guy. Now, it you can actually find Elder Maxon in this game, you, but he's a child and not an elder yet. <laughs> As I think so. For a special assignment, please report to him at once. We've little time to waste before the Enclave seizes this opportunity. Uh, okay, bye. Okay. Oh Steel my God, I leveled. Will... Hey, there we go. Completed death from above. So that's going to be the end of this video as soon as we level up, because I know you guys like to watch me. 
Yeah, so you get this to 40. And there we go. See, now that everything here is up to 40, I can put my points into whatever the hell I want. Because now I know that there's at least enough books in the world and all the DLCs to level up everything to 100. Uh, what do we want here? Demolitions experts. Cannibal. Night person. Here and no, not here and now. Oh, I'm an Eminem. Do do do. Endless civil attack. Impartial mediation. Gunslinger. We use mostly energy weapons. Is there anything good for energy weapons? Uh, I wish I could have some more of these things. Oh, I don't have the endurance, that's why I have to wait till level 30 for all of that shit to go to level 9! Can I be a lobber? What? Oh, I'm not- I'm only level 13. Right. I can be a sight. 